Hey guys, Joe Potch here. Um, I wanted to talk really quickly about um, Macintosh systems and the new update they have called Mac OS Mojave. It's the latest upgrade you can get for your Macintosh systems to, it's kind of like Sierra and High Sierra and all the, the big system upgrades where it has a new name and a new background. I know QuickTime Player that I'm using to record this screen recording is laggy as you can see by the mouse. That doesn't uh, matter. What matters is what I'm telling you, because this is pretty important for people that wonder why you can't download Mac OS Mojave. Well, the main reason seems to be compatibility, and I'm here to address that uh, issue in a very quick, easy video. This is not a how-to fix for your Mac to be able to uh, have it. Mac OS Mojave, I don't know if there's a way you can get it on what I'm about to say on older systems, but let's go to the App Store. Uh, so here's Mac OS Mojave. If you want to find the updates for your system, like not just the updates that pop in the right-hand corner, like right there, but the big system updates where it just completely revamps your Mac, like High Sierra, Sierra, those type of things, you either go to the App Store or you can go on the Mac website and it should say if they have them or not. But So here it is. You can get it on the App Store. It's free. So we're going to try and download it. You click download. looks like it's going well with that spinny thing, and we run into an error right about now. Um... So we could not complete your purchase. This version of Mac OS 10.14 cannot be installed on this computer. Why might you ask? Well, let's go to the problem in a quick and easy why it's doing this. So check compatibility is the first thing Apple.com suggests when you try and upgrade to Mac OS Mojave. Here's their website. Check compatibility. Here's the Mac systems that are compatible with Mojave, and here they are right here. MacBook introduced in early 2015 or later, MacBook Air introduced in mid-2012 or later, MacBook Pro introduced in mid-2012 or later, and Mac Mini introduced in late 2012 or later. I have a 2010 Mac Mini, that's why I cannot get Mojave on my Mac, and it's obviously right here. It says it right on their website, try to download it, it can't. And we go back, certainly enough, I do not have a Mac Mini 2012 because the system simply is just, my, my Mac is just older and will it's not compatible. There may be ways around this in the future where someone could like jailbreak it or hack into it and, and get it in a way, but I think that would screw up the Mac entirely. That's just an opinion, but here's compatibility. Take a moment right here. Sorry, again, the mouse is laggy, but take a moment to look right here. The compatibility, just take a moment to look and see if your Mac is compatible or not. Um... Sadly, as soon as you realize if you do or do not have a compatible Mac, you can either use Mojave and get it, or you can't. There's a, right, right now, there's no way around it. There might be tutorials online on how to get it on older Mac systems, but for Mac Mini, um, you cannot get it. If it's 2011 or, or earlier, 2012, you can get it. But And there are 2010s that you can get. MacBook, Mac Pro, you can get a mid-2010. It's compatible on that. Uh, with a recommended metal compatible capable graphics card. I don't know what that is. So, yeah. Um, and let's not bring it on, blame it on Apple. We have to keep up to date with systems. It sh I wish it was compatible with older systems, but it's whatever. Now, the one thing you will run into problems eventually is if you do not get the latest update every time for a Mac, some games on the App Store require you to have a certain update, a certain Mac system, such as Mojave, High Sierra, Sierra, or the game won't work, or things won't work, or certain apps will not load, because you have to have the latest update, as Mojave is the latest currently, as, in a 20, as of 2018. So, I know it kind of stinks, but if you want to keep up to date and have everything working smoothly on your Mac, get a new Mac. It should last you at least 10 of the system updates before you probably have to buy a new Mac. I don't know. But that's just why your Mac system isn't compatible is because is because it's older and you have to have an up-to-date one or one that they one that'll actually be compatible with the latest one. Now hi Sierra and Sierra, it works on my Mac just fine. But we had to do some we had to do a little bit of tweaking for this Mac, because even then it had problems with High Sierra. So, um, hopefully that guys, ho hopefully that kind of helped you out. This isn't a how to fix or how to get Mojave on your system. That's not how. This is not a tutorial. I'm just telling you the news so you know.